Hey, guess where we are this Monday? Happy Monday to you. I said we'd be somewhere in Illinois, and we just arrived at my parents' house. Brian is still bringing stuff in from the car, and uh, we're very low-tech today, just my computer. <laughs> uh, and we will be high-tech, though, on Saturday, so I hope you'll join me either live, uh, that's as high-tech as you can get, to be there in person for my 30th annual concert, uh, or you can join me um, and still get the energy of the audience um, live streamed. Um, so uh, that's, I, I don't know if I left a link for that or not, but it's murielanderson.com slash DG. That'll give you all the info. But um, I'll play a couple tunes for you just because it's Monday, and we can, and uh, be sure to text in if you have some comments. I see already a hi to, to Michael, who's uh, uh, chiming in. And then maybe I'll, I'll show you around my parents' house, maybe see what my mother's cooking. I can smell something coming from the kitchen. So, uh, let's see. We'll start off uh, just with something a little fun. Play a couple parts at once. I learned this from Pete Hutlinger, this little part. Little Stevie Wonder. And a couple little guitar riffs there. Hello to you, uh, a little Stevie Wonderish. Hello, and uh, oh hey, Radomir is uh, <laughs> is chiming in here. Uh, it's funny he says Queen of the Guitar because uh, I just ran across a photo of a guy in Germany, a, a wonderful friend now, who's who decided to put on a house concert at his community center, and he found out he only sold like eight tickets. He's got this big community center, so. He had a decal painted on his guitar that said Muriel Anderson, Queen of the Guitar, <laughs> or Queen of Finger Style, something like that, and with the date and time. And he filled that place. He just drove that little car, a uh, little smart car, all around town. And by the time of the concert, it was, it was completely filled. So, <laughs> brilliant. Uh, and uh, let's see, another hello here. David says, hey, and um, thank you, from St. Louis, yeah. And greetings also to John from St. Louis. I want to thank John. On the way here, we were, we have been driving for seven and a half hours straight or, to to get here, and we had got a call from John Wise, and he found a wonderful recipient for the Music for Life Alliance Award that we're going to be giving on Saturday night. Because a portion of the proceeds benefits Music for Life Alliance, that John has helped to make that a reality. So we support grassroots organizations that are get, getting instruments and lessons to kids. 
and we'll be doing a, a little presentation. Maybe, maybe sing it in shanty form. We'll see. Sing, sing the. We'll sing the presentation. Uh, so we have a wonderful special guest. It's still li listed as surprise guest, but I'll let you know who it is. It's Tom Castle, and he's just a great, really authentic uh, sh shanty singer. And to play uh, the push button accordion and just great, uh, great little touch uh, that's going to really make you feel like you are on that sailboat, sailing with us up the coast of Maine, having all those adventures. And we'll have the backdrops that Brian took from our two months sail in Maine and a bunch of new songs written from from that. I won't let all the songs out of the bag, <laughs> so we got got some good ones there. And. Uh, Judy says, hey, and uh, thank you so much, Carl, hello, and Larry, boy, people are uh, popping in now, so, and Dave from Tallahassee, oh, yes, um, so we hope to get to Tallahassee next swing through Florida. We had a wonderful Florida tour uh, we just came back from. It was just so great to feel that energy from the audience, and so now I know how much I miss it and uh, how much... Uh, it's going to make a difference on Saturday to have that live audience. So I uh, appreciate all of you who are there. Uh, oh, I'm going to be playing all, all three of my instruments here, so I'll swing this over here. Uh, this is the harp guitar that I took with me on the sailboat, so it's carbon fiber, as you see. Uh, and there we go. Uh, and uh, that's a great instrument. And then uh, I just got this one back here. This is my tour de force, uh, made, my, uh, made up in Portland, Oregon. Mike Doolin made that. Yeah, it is just, just a lovely sound. Uh, before I play one of the sailing songs, I'll do just a little something so you can hear the instrument. Well, it was just taken out of the car, so it may that's not too too badly out of tune. For just coming out of the car. Well, I'll adjust it as I go, but I just want to, to remind everyone just not to worry. <laughs> it's why worry, Mark Knopfler.
<laughs> All right. Well, what do you think? Should we take you uh, around my parents' house here, show you around a, a little bit? Uh, uh, we'll first got some comments coming in. Uh, let's see if there's anything I need to respond to. Mark says, uh, oh, thank you. It sounds lovely here. Um, Almo uh, is uh, from a rotary in Vancouver. I tell you, uh, oh, it's raining in Vancouver. <laughs> Well, it's supposed to be cool here, but we should should have a good day on Saturday for the concert. So I hope you can all attend. And, of course, if you're attending virtually, uh, then that's uh, it's not such an issue, is it? But uh, Pamela let me know that she only has eight pieces of fudge left. So if you want to get the online version with the fudge, you should order soon. Uh, and, uh, oh, and John, John Wise is here from Southern Illinois. Uh, and hi, Fred and and Mark. Yep. And so I think we are ready to to go t take a look. What do you think? <laughs> they don't know I'm going to do this. Actually, we'll see if we can catch Captain Brian here uh, and my parents. Okay. So this is uh, our living room. So this is where we would uh, play records and uh, dance. Uh, yeah, my sister and I would do ballet dances when we were like three years old here in this living room here. And, uh, and then we're coming into the living room. Oh, here's my dad. So say hello to, to Ted, my, my father hello. here. Say. say you on yeah, there, huh? right. <laughs> <laughs> He's at his computer. This is where we're going to have our dinner tonight. I don't know what it's going to be. I guess we'll find out. We'll find out shortly. So I'll walk in here and... This is the kitchen. This is where the action happens. And, oh, Brian is helping my mother cook. Oh, with the, a little... You have to. You have to glass have a glass of wine, of wine to help. That's right. Yeah. What, uh, what are we having tonight? What are you making? Beef stew and uh, sautéed right saute greens. Beef stew and sautéed greens. Oh, that looks good. I'm in, I'm in charge of the greens here. All right. You've got garlic and olive oil, and salt, and pepper, and some greens that they told me the name. Uh, bok choy? No, it's oh. sort of like that, but not quite. Some Asian name. I didn't pick it up, but uh, yeah, some onions. So. Mm, okay. Well, I'm kind of keeping an eye on how that's going. Then I'll know how long I'll spend with you because uh, I don't want to be late for dinner. Right. There are there are priorities after all. Okay. Here I'm walking kind of fast for you, but we'll walk back through. And into into this. This is where this is the corner where there used to my mother used to have her big church organ right in this corner, and I remember figuring out some notes on it and uh, stepping on the pedals and finding one and five of the chord <laughs> and rocking back and forth and seeing what what I could make up from that. Uh, I couldn't reach the pedal, so I, I had to stand up uh, to play that time and um, my mother built this harpsichord here and let's see what's on the harpsichord stand ah all right I, I, I should have known that's what she's working on some, some Bach and, uh, and an upright piano in case she wants to play a little Scott Joplin you know so uh, you know, I'll play a little uh, little ragtimey thing for you um, um, and then I'll come back and say some more hellos here. I know I missed a couple of you there. So this is the one that I call a fine pickle. By the way, this goes together with my mother's pickle recipe. I'm trying to get in so, so that you can see my fingers in case you're trying to figure it out. Here, I'll, I'll start a little bit like this. So There we go. That's better? I know I have a couple of my students there. We're learning the other two songs I played.
Well, if you come Saturday, we'll show the visuals that go with that. And I wrote that to a film that came from my grandparents uh, during the Prohibition when they went to Canada. And uh, you could see them walking into a bar and staggering out and walking into another bar and staggering out. And so uh, the uh, music was kind of choreographed with that. <laughs> so. Uh, and uh, uh, I want to do one of the sailing tunes over, over with my uh, harp guitar. Yes, we, I see we've got a couple of requests coming in. So, whoa, a whole bunch of uh, notes here. And, uh, oh, Timothy, it's, uh, thanks for, uh, for tuning in again. I'm glad you're tuning in each week now. And Bunny as well. I know you're always here. Um, JP, uh, let's see. And, um, <laughs> and Mark Casey says... Uh, a mighty fine pickle here. So yeah, you'll have to try my mother's pickle recipe. That is in the cookbook. I know a bunch of you picked that up for Christmas, so really do appreciate that, or whoever you're giving it to, the Acoustic Chef book with music. And, uh, and oh, hey, from New Hampshire, good. And, uh, and Jim and Bob. Uh, okay, and let's see. We do have a request here. Uh, oh, hi, Scott, as well, and Cynthia. And uh, we have a re request for uh, that tune, uh, Sailing Dream, there. And hi, Mike, and Richmond also, and Russell. Yeah, yeah, Russ, that's right, one of our old hang buddies here uh, at this house. Great to see you. So thanks, Russ. Well, I don't know how well this, this microphone is picking up. It's just a simple computer mic, so nothing fancy. So, But uh, let me know if it's coming through well enough. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll sing this one for you. Oh, I think this, uh, this guitar is taking a little bit to settle in. Maybe I'll take, take the other one. to get used to the new temperature. So this is the one that came in a dream altogether, so that's why I call it Sailing Dream. And here again you'll see all the images behind it on Saturday when you come. Oh, here's a little secret too. Everyone who, who's coming live, we're going to be giving them a little jar of sand that we collected on the different islands as we were touring in, in Maine. So you'll get to experience the music, the visuals, and have part of the beach to take home with you as well. and live from day to day Where life is not predictable Wondering what is round the very next bay I'd like to raise the sails again Watching for the whales again And never have to say I wish that I had done the things that I can't do And I'm too old to play To breathe again again, laugh again, love again in real life. Sail is unfurled again to be part of the 
this world again on my time I'd like to pull the anchor in and sail to where I've never been with sunset on our lee Awaken to the sparkles on the water then I'm feeling free To jibe again, tack again I am now back again in real life I'd like to sail the world again Ooh. I'd like to sail the world again So nice of you to come by at my visit my parents' house here, and uh, glad we arrived in time to, to do this for you. We uh, drove all day today because we want to make sure to get here in time for tomorrow morning and early afternoon when I'm going to visit uh, the high schools, Downers North and Downers South, and play for their guitar classes um, to kick some questions and hopefully you know inspire some some pickers to uh, continue with it and continue learning. So that's it's really such, been such a great thing for me that you know we have to have to do that. We have to spread the love whatever way we, we can. And I want to uh, in, uh, just say happy Thanksgiving to you all speaking of spreading the love and in whatever way you celebrate it. Uh, we, here we do it very traditionally with the extended family and whatever way you celebrate uh, just appreciating friends and family and uh, giving thanks for all the wonderful things that, that we have here still. So um, it's a reminder to uh, uh, find gratitude in things. There's just, life is still wonderful despite what the news says. Despite what the news says, life is still wonderful and can be. Yep. Uh, so uh, just uh, some last so longs and uh, Thank you to, to you all for saying Happy Thanksgiving back. Uh, yeah, thanks, Cynthia. And uh, Instrumental Music Channel, oh, that's, that's cool. Uh, oh, from Shrewsbury, Shropshire, England. Oh, I tell you, I had some of the best tea there. There's a little tea shop in uh, Shrewsbury. Uh, if you find uh, Klemsch's Liquor tea, let me know. I've been. I had that once there. It, it might have been just this one shop that had it, but I've never found it since. And that's still my very favorite tea, Clemsch's Lookwar. Okay, remember that one. <laughs> All right. Uh, and oh, Rudolph, I'm glad we'll see you Saturday. Great, uh, James. And uh, great. And uh, thanks that the, uh, the voice is picking up. That's good to know, Bob. All right. And. Uh, my students who are learning the uh, first two tunes that I've played, so thanks. I, I've really, really been enjoying teaching more. I'm teaching th now through True Fire and a, a program called String Masters, where you can do one-on-one, -on -one and uh, it's really a very personal way to learn. And I've got a couple of beginners, a couple of kids, so it's great to uh, do uh, do that. You know, find really fun things that are easy to play. So it's a it's a different type of inspiration for me to, to, to teach you. So I want to say I really do enjoy teaching you. Um, so thanks, and hey to the Smokies, and I think I am smelling dinner and seeing things kind of coming to the table, towards the table. So I think that means that uh, we will see you on Saturday. Uh, tune in online, um, or uh, come see me in Downers Grove. So either way, have a wonderful Thanksgiving, and um, we'll, we'll share some more Thursday and Saturday, and then the next Monday live, of course. All right, see you then. Bye.